I, uh, marriage has been a year of marriage, which is good. I like that. Uh, okay, you bitter people. Whatever. Oh, forget this love. Uh, I am married. Uh, I'll tell you guys right now, the worst part about being married, though, is talking to my wife's single friends about the losers that they're dating. And I put losers in quotation mark because what a woman thinks is a loser is not what a guy thinks is a loser at all. I was talking to one of my wife's friends the other day. She's like, oh my god. I went on a date with this loser last night. He's such a loser, he works at a pawn shop, and every time somebody brings in a sword, he takes it home. He has like 10 swords! And I'm like, oh my god, you know somebody with 10 swords? That's amazing! We can play pirate versus ninjas, five on five. Text that guy right now, why aren't we sword fighting? She kept talking about this guy, she was like, also, he's such a loser, he plays so much Call of Duty on the PlayStation 3, he was ranked the number one player in New York City. And I'm like, oh, you know Bradley underscore Skywalker. <laughs> yeah, he's my best friend in the PlayStation 3. You're gonna end up alone. Too picky. That's what it is, man. I hang out with my wife's friend a lot, like with her and her friends. I realize that women, uh, they don't take dry spells the same way men do. Like I was talking, like, well, hanging out with one of my friends, and like one of her was talking about not having sex for two years. She's like, I haven't had sex in two years, and they all just laugh, like, Oh my God, girl, we need to get you laid. If a guy's talking about not having sex for two years, he's usually holding a knife, and there's hostages involved. Like that's that's how serious a guy's like. I haven't had a lady in two years, and the girl she's like, Look, we gonna get you a date. Just let the people go. Like that's I'm telling you, man. That's why I don't understand why when negotiators. Like, I'm in that situation, why don't just offer somebody a hand job? Like, yeah. like, if I'm like, I want a million dollars, or you can get a hand job from Jennifer Lopez, all right, forget the million dollars. Like, who would, who would not take the hand job? Okay, anyways, never mind, just me, all right, just me. I get it, I get it, I get it. I'm a better man, I guess, than all of y'all. Yeah, but women are arrogant, man, when they, get, when they reject dudes. I was at a bar the other day, and I heard this, I heard a guy go up to a girl, and he was like, yo, ma, you beautiful. You like beautiful. And she was like, really? That's your best move? You're trying to get me back to your place and that's your best move? And I was afraid for her. I was afraid he was gonna be like, nah, that ain't my best move to get you back to my place, this is. And then he was gonna pull out a chloroform rag <laughs> and just knock her out, <laughs> right? Because then when she woke up in this place, all she can do is give credit where credit is due. She'd be like, all right, it worked, I'm here. Oh my God, is that 10 swords? Like, that's all she can do. That's all she can do.